Find insight, guidance, and answers. answers. Tune into Spirit with radio medium Laura Lee. Laura Lee. Laura Lee, tuning into Mr. Brian's spirit. Welcome, Brian. Hi, Laura. How are you? I'm doing good. Where are you calling from? I'm in Oswego, Illinois. Oh, right. First impressions I'm receiving is a couple, and they seem to be flanking you. So I see wedding bands. When they're this close, and they're like right alongside of you on each side, it's like parental figures. Yes. And they're buried together. Like they rest together. Right. They had been together for years. <laughs> right, right. Like since they were kids almost. Yeah, they were quite young. Mm-hmm. They are close enough that you got to spend time and also you got time. You're pretty close to where they are right now, resting. And they said that you've come to visit them. Uh, I have an occasion, yeah. And so they want to say thank you, Brian. <laughs> Okay. okay, thank you. Who had the red hair, honey? Uh, I did when I was a baby. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Carrot top. <laughs> yeah. Irish, Irish hair. I love it. I feel like only begotten son. Don't know if you're the only, but I just... Yeah, only child. Only child. Oh. No wonder you are the sun and the moon. <laughs> As somebody here, I feel total pain in the heart. I don't know if they had heart problems. Could have been associated also with high cholesterol, that type of thing. When I say the heart and high cholesterol, is that also associated to one of your parents? Could have been my dad. He passed in his sleep, but he wasn't one to go to the doctor. So it's kind of un- unknown. Right. So it was a heart failure there. Yeah, yeah. He says it's really important that, you know, you take good care of yourself. Mm-hmm. So not following his footsteps. Yes, <laughs> you know, so mm-hmm. if you're resisting doctors, go and get your checkups and you know what to do. I don't even need to say it to you. You know what to do, but just do it. All right. As I say that, did you smoke at one time and or did your father? He never did, but I did and still do, and still do. Wow. It's just a confirmation to the message. So you get what he's saying to you. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. You've got a ways to go, hon. Make it count. And also, I do see you near somebody's bed, and I'm feeling like this might be your mom. Towards her end of life, like you were very much there for her. Yes and no. <laughs> Unfortunately, when she passed in the hospital, I was at work, so I didn't get really get to say goodbye. You had been up there, though, to hang out with her. Oh, yeah, mm-hmm. true. Yes, and she says you were always there by her side. The hospital was my second home, yeah. yeah. Right. She says, thank you. I just feel that was such a difficult time to lose both of them then at that one point. But they want you to know that you're not alone. They got you, and they're watching you because you are... Their beautiful son. <laughs> I hate to scare. <laughs> thank you, Brian, for sharing your time with me. All right, Laura. Well, thank you. You're welcome. And if you'd like to call into the pre recorded show, sign up at Radio Medium, com. Remember, you can tune in to your spirit each and every day by subscribing to the podcast. Please rate it and share it. We'd appreciate that. And then you can join the conversation with me over at Radio Medium. Or Elite Group on Facebook. I'd love to hear from you.